Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to be drawing some different logos and some, yeah, just logos because, you know, it's really all I got to do. So here, let me just uh, search it up. And yeah, I'll just, yeah, alright. Okay, let me do famous logos. Alright. Go to images. Let's see an easy one. Yeah, how about... Let's start with the YouTube logo. Yeah. Just like... Yeah. You know, just gotta start it off with the thing I'm recording on. Should be pretty easy. Oh, that's way too high of a It's got a notification for the YouTuber. Okay, but honestly, I didn't really care, but because uh, it's not really logo. Because I, I'm like, I just like draw like the wedges. But here's the YouTube symbol. I'm not coloring, but um, yeah. Alright, let's see here. Okay, yeah, let's do Adidas. <sighs> that is way too fat. Basically the same except we need to make it like that. There we go. I swear to god I was doing way better on these when I was at school doing this. That's where I got this idea video idea from. Just draw, cause like I got bored at school and then I just started drawing some logos I found, like my logo for my shoe, for my school shoe, um, and my logo for my glasses, that was pretty cool, and then my, my f probably favorite one was the Mr. Sketch, which uh, took the longest, yeah, when I was drawing this R for the Adidas earlier ago, it was like hard. I mean, not the R, S. What am I talking about? Like, I had to make it fat in some parts. Because I, like, it was way too skinny in some of the parts. Oh my god, what is that? Yeah. Yeah, I made that. Yeah, that looks better. I can kind of see that. Yeah, draw it this way. That's that's way better. Okay, we need to make it fat. Alright. Uh this is kinda still this is like still messed up that way. Yeah, here's the Adidas. Kinda looks like a B but yeah, it's Adidas. I swear to god, it was not messed as up. But not that messed up I mean. Let's do Gucci. <laughs> it's your boy. Alright, so that one is like, okay. Need it to go exactly.
Alright guys, I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Let's get back to our drawing. All right, we're on Gucci. I don't, I don't know. Uh, I need to put the little. And then we have Gucci. Let's do let's do Baskin Robbins. There we go. I don't know if we're gonna draw the outside, like the circle on the outside, but yeah. Oh by the way, um in Basket Robbins, uh there is uh it says uh one it's like a thirteen and then something else. I forgot like what it meant. But it was like it was like different I think it's like thirteen different flavors or whatever. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty cool. Cause like it's like a hidden message. Okay, that the middle, the middle right there is way too skinny. I need to make that. There you go. That's better, I guess. But um, okay. Uh, on the other side, where it has the R. Alright, now I just need to draw the, uh, the word. That S is weird, but, you know, I draw my S is weird, so. That K is weird. <laughs> I draw my K's weird, so like my sometimes my K's will look like uh, I don't know. Here, let me show you, cause I I, I did it to where I point my K's like started kind of look like like an F H. Like here. Can you see that? Wait right here, yeah. See, that's how it, like I started drawing my K's in sixth grade, which I am, but then I started towards the end. Which we are towards the end because I'm still in sixth grade, but uh, it started. I I, I just drew 
normal caves. But, um, yeah, that's how I started drawing my caves when I first got in. Yeah, I realized it was, like, weird, so I stopped drawing them, like, so I stopped writing them like that. Oh, that's pointing. Alright, so I'm just going to draw the robins. Now I need to draw the, write the R in the little side. I don't know what that stands for, but I do know um, TM means trademark, and uh, I think uh, C means uh, copyrighted, and I think R, yeah, the R, I think it, uh, I think it means register. Pro it probably means register. I don't know. Oh, now it's pointed. I keep on like forgetting to put the pointed part. I keep on thinking it's like flat for the end. And draw that weird S. And now the little R. There you go. Got the basket. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna draw the circle around, it's fine. But yeah, here's the Baskin Robin logo. That's actually probably my favorite right now. It looks pretty cool. Alright, uh, let's go. Let's go on the back of the paper. Let's do the Pepsi. Yeah. PB, PBC, what? So like, Pepsi Bottles Incorporated. I don't know. Alright, so, draw a circle. Uh, do I have anything that's like circular? I don't know. I'll just do it on scratch. No, not scratch. You know what I'm talking about? Because, like, isn't it like scratch where you just start off with something? Yeah, I think so, yeah. So I'm not starting off scratch. The only thing I need to do is draw the middle part, and I'll, like, do, do the other shapes on the outside. So, yeah, the, the white part. That's all I really need to do. And then, yeah, I need to draw the word Pepsi. That's pretty good, I think. I mean, that's pretty similar, so... Hold on, I need to, like... Make that go a little step, the bottom part to go a little steeper. All right, there we go. That, yeah, that's pretty good. All right. I need to draw that circle a little more good. Like when I when I first drew drew the circle, it actually looked pretty good. All right, that's good, I guess. Now let's draw the Pepsi. I like how like all these logos are like different, like they like the letters look so different. Uh, it's just really cool. It's a big O oh, in the middle of that Pepsi. Why they have to make it like waves on the E? That's weird. That's a big E, but whatever, man. <laughs> I'm not drawing that wave, that weird wave E again. Draw the S, alright. Their S is normal. Which means it's probably gonna be hard to draw. Or not, but that is too tall. Alright, let's erase that. This is way too tall.
Alright, that's good enough. Let's see. Bye. And there you have it, Pepsi. It's pretty cool. Yes. Alright, um, I only have room for a couple more because I'm only doing one sheet of paper. But. Oh, they have a whole thing of a picture like full of diff, like a lot of Burger King. Like logos. Uh, I'm probably not gonna do that though. Mm. What should I do next? Let's do Apple. Yeah, seems pretty easy. No, no, no. Yeah, let's do Amazon. They, they have, they, they have a letter, letters, and um, they have the word and like the smile. It's pretty cool. And also in Amazon, as the Amazon, and then it has the arrow. And it front and it first starts off at A and then it goes to Z on the Amazon word. Which like they have like items from A to Z. It's pretty cool. Another hidden missions. Oh they wrote their A in like the like the fancy way of an A. Like like the like the really weird way of writing A. You know what I'm talking about? Here, like here, let me show you. See, it's like, who even writes A's like that? It's so weird. Like, honestly, it is. And the Z. You have to kind of make it like curved at the bottom a bit because like that's where the arrow is going. Neat. I don't know, let's draw the arrow. Going yeeting across this and over here. Boom. Bop. Clap. All right. Now for the O and the N. We'll probably do Apple after this. Well, that O is like too far apart. There we go. And now for the N. And there we go. Amazon. I think it looks pretty cool. Yeah. Alright. Let's go on to the next one, which is uh, Apple. I actually tried drawing it once. I mean, just from like scratch, because, well, no, not from scratch, but I tried drawing it once and it looked horrible because, like, I didn't look at anything. This. <laughs> I can't even draw an apple, like, I just draw, like, a circle and then, the, like, the leaf. So, yeah, I just did that one really quick. There's the apple. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I think we have, yeah, we have room for one more. Let's do FedEx. Not sponsored. Okay. <laughs> it's way too big. Why did I choose that one? Uh, here, this one. Yeah, it's good. And, let's do it. This is, like, just, like, normal. I just looked at one it was, like, really, really made. Oh, by the way, in FedEx, um, in between the E and the X put together, it's an arrow. Which is really cool. Another hidden uh, message, whatever. The E. In FedEx, like the letters are like all together, but like it's just like normal. 
This is like really hard to draw. For me. <laughs> now. Okay, that's the Fed. Now onto the X. So we need to have the E like. What's. What is. Oh, okay. And then we need to move that like X to go at the tip right here. And then we have to make it look like the uh, arrow. So yeah, that's a big arrow, but whatever, man. And then there you go, FedEx. And yeah, that's that's all of the that's all of the um, logos I'm gonna be doing today. And uh, my favorite side is the first side I did because like the YouTube it looks good, Adidas looks good, the Gucci looks good. My favorite is probably the Baskin Robbins, but like this side is just like kind of messy. I didn't really try, but my pro Probably my favorite one on this side is gotta be uh, Amazon, yeah. And Amazon looks pretty good. So yeah, um, hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you like this video, subscribe, and if you want to see every video I make, make sure you turn on the notification. And uh, yeah, I will see you in the next one. Bye.